Hello and welcome to a quick overview of the integration between VMware vCenter Log Insight and the vCenter Operations Management Suite. Log Insight provides automated log management using log aggregation, analytics, and search to provide operational intelligence and enterprise wide visibility for organizations to increase efficiency, security, and compliance in dynamic hybrid cloud environments. So for our demonstration today, we will be looking at a scenario where one of our internal customers has been complaining about some pretty bad storage latency, or what they believe to be storage latencies, on VMs hosted on a particular ESXi host. What we can do is we can log into Log Insight and see if we have any of those types of alerts in our infrastructure or in our environment. So let's go ahead and look in the search window, and let's type in SCSI performance deteriorated and we'll see if anything matches that. That will auto-complete for us. So let's go ahead and hit that search and see if anything comes up that's related to SCSI performance deteriorations in our environment. And it looks like we do. We have 116 events that it's showing us here, but it was on one particular host that we were noticing the problem. And this was the one running some of our business critical applications. So let's go ahead and limit the search again and let's see if that particular host actually has any problems. So let's go ahead and add a constraint and let's say if the host name equals and again here it's going to allow us to start typing and then auto complete the entry for us. And this is the one we're looking for. And we'll hit search and see if any of those come back. And sure enough, actually they do. So for this particular time frame, we've had 22 different events and occurrences where the SCSI performance has given us an alert. So it looks like there are a number of events that have been sent to Log Insight. Let's go ahead and see how bad this really is. So let's go ahead and say uh, latency in microseconds is greater than, we'll say, 1 million. That's pretty bad. And sure enough, there are actually quite a few alerts in the system that are saying that the particular host we're looking for has experienced performance deterioration from a SCSI standpoint in the form of something greater than 1 million microseconds. And that's something that we'd like to be alerted to if and when that does occur. So what we can do then is we can go to our drop down menu next to the search button and we can add an alert. Now this alert will be added based on the three constraints that we have defined. So we'll see SCSI performance deteriorated, the host name is the one that we specified, and anything where the latency in microseconds gets greater than 1 million. Let's call that alert high SCSI latency. We can put additional notes in here if we want to describe exactly what this alert is. We can also email the alert, or we can send that alert over to vCenter Operations, which is exactly what we'd like to do today. So let's uncheck email, click Send to vCenter Operations, and now we choose which resource on vCenter Operations that we'd like to send it to. We're going to go ahead and put in W2, search for that, and scroll down to where we see our host, which is right there. So now, for this particular alert, when it goes over to vCenter Operations, it will be placed in this particular object. So then we can determine the criticality. Let's go ahead and make this a critical alert, and then we can decide when to raise the alert on any match, or if a particular event occurs more than a certain number of times in a particular window of time, etc. For now, let's just leave it on any time that it matches. Then we'll go ahead and send that alert. We'll hit Save. And now if we go back and look at our alerts, we can see that we have a new alert called High SCSI Latency, and it's been enabled, and it's ready to run the next time that particular type of log message is seen in our system. So now if we flip over again to vCenter Operations and go to that particular host, if the event occurs again, we'll be able to see it in vCenter Operations. Now there's a new button in vCenter Operations. It's the Show Notification Event button. Alerts from Log Insight come over as notification events. So we're going to go ahead and click on that, and you can see where this alert has occurred since we initially created it. Here is our notification, identification, start time, resource, and then the actual log event down here. Another great feature about the vCenter operations and Log Insight integration is that it is a two-way integration. 
And what we mean by that is that we can send alerts from Log Insight into vCenter Operations and have them appear here in the event window. Or we can also, in many different places, highlight a particular object in vCenter Operations. In this case, this particular host. And then go to the action bar and choose Search for Logs in vCenter Log Insight. And then it will log us right into Log Insight, bring us to all the events associated with that particular object. So that really helps us if we are troubleshooting and we've got a particular issue where we've narrowed down things to an exact object in vCenter Operations. We know what's having the problem, but we need to get more detailed information about why it's particularly acting that way. So then we can come in here, start our troubleshooting process with the log messages with just one simple click. So to recap, we've seen how VMware vCenter Log Insight integrates with VC Operations Management Suite to help provide automated log management using log aggregation, analytics, and search to provide you with operational intelligence and enterprise-wide visibility so you can increase efficiency, security, and compliance in your dynamic hybrid cloud environments. For more information about vCenter Log Insight, please visit VMware.com. Thank you.